looking good this dark thing um, anyways let's see what Mustangs over here Civic's gone yay right nope right here look at this Ooh, water hole boom ready for transfer now gonna give you the backdrop on these two cars um, bought this car two years ago no last year a year ago bought this car a year ago didn't buy it I actually traded for it um, not gonna lie uh, know a lot about this car there's a guy had this car that blew the car up um, the engine everything is in the basement car is a solid car no rust great body um, worst damage is you got busted headlight this nasty old pink crap and then the rooftop is uh, the paint peeled on it and you can see you got a little spot right there the paint's peeling other than that this car is excellent Shelly I mean excellent even down to the, almost like new rubber on it um, these were white. The boy painted black right before they got rid of it. Um, you guys probably seen this in a few videos. If you go back and watch a few videos, you've seen some of it sitting in the background. Um, like I said, this car is pretty much mint. You see, it's already got the header, full stainless the back. Um, motor's just been ripped plum out. Um, as you see, this is Pepto pink, and it's ugly as crap. Um, so, and as you see, all kinds of extra holes and stuff. Um, I think we're going to try to clean that up and repaint the engine bay before we do this swap. Now, this car, like I said, this car is mint. It's getting dark on me, so it'll be hard to see. You see, it's setting low. It's not as low as the other one. We'll get it to it in a minute, but it's, it's, it's pretty low. Um, it's kind of mess, but you can see right there the door panels turn loose there this piece is there other than that the CD player is missing it's got a short throw sh shifter already in it um, other than that it's all stock I mean everything is in pretty mint shape um, perfect uh, floorboard aim wet uh, gotta put this mirror in this car other than the top rust wise is mint they painted that door I don't know why we're gonna try to find a matching paint matching door for that or see we can't get that painted off or match it paint it or something um, back here as you can see exhaust of course this is the EX um, but this is full stainless back um, body on this car is perfect I've had this car, I can't remember, it's been one or two years I've had this car. I ain't really done nothing with it. Um, I traded for it. I didn't buy it, I actually traded for it. And and how, how that worked out was I actually uh, bought a rail cab Ford two-wheel drive, um, 4.2. Uh, frame was perfect under it. Uh, engine wouldn't run unless I put gas down it wiring problem with the uh, electronic theft lock um, did a lot of stuff I could do to it um, Gav already had the gas tank and uh, all kinds of stuff was replaced or needed replaced on it um, so I actually uh, bought the truck off a, a friend um, he brought it up to my house and dropped it off um, I didn't even look at it uh, bought the truck for 300 bucks my intentions was it was a 460 uh, big block down in it. I had a fiberglass bed lined out, a step side bed, bed to make me a uh, make me a lightning co copy. It's gonna make a lightning copy as far as we'll do. And uh, guy with a 460 build, and then just kind of sat here for about two weeks, and this car popped up, and I knew the car rather well, real well. Um, so I hit the guy up. He wanted like 800 bucks for it. It's got full skunk two uh, suspension all underneath of it. That's all new. Coilovers all the way around. Brand new wheels and tires. Um, 
trying to think what else is brand new exhaust that's underneath of it um, and it had a B18 with it uh, complete B18 but it was tore apart um, they were running a 10 to 1 compression I do believe with it it's a fast little car nice little car um, loved the car drove the car a few times before it got blowed up um, I actually burnt the bearings up in it that's what happened which comes back to my uh, uh, reason to buying this car right here whole reason to buying this car was at least 600 bucks to get that B18 built back together because it's tore apart I don't know what's missing boy it had it just tore it out um, I have the pistons and rods and all the some of the aftermarket stuff but like the aftermarket intake was missing um, radiator fan is missing out of it uh, let's say the crank I got to have the tr crank check make sure the bearings and I think it scratched one in but not too bad um, but I figured about set down figured out good stuff six six hundred bucks to rebuild a motor all new stuff and loud parties a couple hundred dollars for random stuff um, six hundred dollars been looking pricing keep an eye on stuff um, keep putting it off keep putting it off this one came up on line 89 hatchback subframe gone um, 400 bucks message the guy I figured it was just maybe a parts car so he sent me a bunch of pictures show me where the subframe started rusting ain't really it's, it's kind of the subframe was not and rock panel was gone like I said it's dark you can't really see and uh, all the other work he's done over here he's uh, cut all this out um, so I thought well wouldn't hurt asked him said, well it wouldn't hurt asked him uh, hey how was the engine what kind of engine was it in it um, done got to the point with this Civic set for so long that I did not uh, I'll just go drop a D16 in it and uh, run it more as a daily maybe a fun little daily pretty much once this want this car as a stance car anyways I didn't want to to be super fast I mean if I want to build something fast I got this one to build I got the Fox I'm going to eventually build as a drag I mean the S10 ain't necessarily slow but if I want something to build I got for speed I got already got stuff lined out that's um, pretty much uh, downright cheaper and probably already at the point that one of these would be if I threw a turbo on it. So I pretty much got this other car for uh, here. I got this car for a donor just to get this car on the road. Um, he said, "Yeah, the engine run." He sent me some videos on it, and I was like, "Yeah, that, it's worth 400 bucks to me just for have the engine, and then it's five-speed transmission, even though the post said automatic." Um, got over, got Logan, got BS, and it's the guy's first car. He's had it for a long time, sold it, got bought it back, whatnot. Long story, chit chatting. Uh, but it's got the ZC motor in it, and the whole CRX front end under it. Uh, it's got slotted disc brakes. Um, it's got a lot of good stuff already, kind of slammed into a cheap way of doing it. Uh, so I'm at this debate right now. This car subframe ain't that bad. Um, he done bought the panels, patch panels for here, and these patch panels for rockers, which I ain't found them yet. Um, it's got one spot, or two spots on the other side, which if you look at the previous video, you'd see. Mustang. Um, so, is this car worth fixing? Or is this car worth parting out? stealing everything off of it sending her right down the road for somebody else to play with or junker crusher um, like I said if I'd swap it over I'd swap the motor the ZC over um, I'll probably just do a full front end swap um, I'm not sure I need to measure there's some difference in them I'm not sure what uh, I'll do some research uh, 
to do a full swap over. Once uh, you get everything swapped over, um, you know, it's like, do I want these wheels, or do I want those wheels, or do I want to keep those back for a spare? Um, if you look at these cars, they're same, almost same wheelbase, same length. This car's a, probably a hell of a lot lighter. This car right here. This car here is probably a hell of a lot lighter than this car. Um, but we're not building a drag car. I mean, I, mean, I don't know. The other option is throw some sheet metal on this one. Throw it all back together, halfway decent. Um, buy a cheap eBay turbo kit, slam on it, and hit the flashlight drags. Um, yeah, or you can swap everything over this one and do that one. Even though this one has all its interior and everything, this one's stripped for racing. Um, so you can see where I'm stuck at with this. And I also have the B18C1 engine block intake or not intake uh yeah i have an intake for it now um pretty much everything other than a bearing kit and a gasket kit to put that motor back together so um i do have to send the head off to, to have it checked out so to swap all this over make me a fun little car out of this one and maybe drop the b18 in this one boy that had this said to be he had a b18 in it and this one stock was faster than a stock B18. I don't believe that, um, but I don't know what this engine has done to it either. She does leave a little black mark. So, yeah. All I can say is stay tuned more for the Civic Swap. Um, don't know what else to really say about that other than let's get right here. Stay tuned for more. See what we're going to do with both Civics. Um, like I said, the one's just a great body. Um, regardless of what it is, it's too good to let it go. Um, yeah, stay tuned more. The Civic Swap. Like, subscribe, and enjoy.